Farmers from Hastings and Elkton would come to town with produce via the old Hastings Road just south of this location. Moultrie was equally busy with lumber and turpentine in addition to citrus groves and produce from family gardens. Florida would become one of the largest states in the cattle industry and St. Johns County ranches were growing. Like the farmers and lumbermen, the area ranchers also passed by this trough. As many of you know, Albert Lewis was a winter resident from Bear Creek, Pennsylvania, who was in the lumber and ice business. He was a member of the Good Roads League with other businessmen whose goal was to promote good roads in the state of Florida. At his own expense, Mr. Lewis improved local roads and streets and beautified them with trees, palms, and flowering shrubs. His benevolence was felt by the local hospital, churches, and schools, through charity events and fundraisers. At current St. Augustine South, he created a picnic area at Moultrie Point and constructed a road to it, what we know now as Lewis Point Road. He built a picnic pavilion and a rustic palmetto shelter for picnickers to escape the rain and a wharf so the area could be accessed by boat. In his biography of Albert Lewis, F. Charles Petrillo commented that many of the loans extended by him before his death were never met when he died. This project started last year when I noticed all of the trailers were gone from this site, which was the former San Juan Trailer Park. Many years ago, I learned from my late cousin, Roy Barnes Sr., that the structure was a water trough and I was concerned it would be mistaken as a planter and get torn down. I offered my services to Mr. Arbizani to research its history and take the steps necessary to arrange for a city marker.